Hey Nerd Room fans, welcome back to another brand new Marvel Legends unboxing video. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so. I have a whole bunch of unboxing videos I've done already, and a lot more to come. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. Um, brand new episode, brand new unboxing, brand new Marvel Wave. So I just got my hand on a whole bunch of figures from the uh, Call Obsidian Wave, the... Infinity War wave number two, and I've been really looking forward to doing it. I'm really excited to do it. So, um, without any further ado, we're going to get the first one. We're going to do Thor from Infinity War. I'm really excited about this one, just because he had, comes with Stormbreaker. And, uh, basically, yeah, it's, uh, if you've seen the movie, you know what moment this is the Thor that comes through the, uh, the Rainbow Bridge, I guess you could say. And for the big hero moment. Or one of the hero moments. So, anyways. I'm going to, you know, stop spoiling the movie. We're going to talk about the figure. It's going to be pretty cool. We might spoil the movie a little bit, but I'm pretty sure you've seen the movie. So, I'm going to shut up about, you know, rambling on. And uh, we're going to open the box. So, I live in New Hampshire. If I can find Thor at a Walmart, you could probably find him somewhere too. So... Anyways, uh, this is the Thor from Infinity War, uh, looking very cool, looking awesome to me. Been really looking forward to getting this wave, obviously. Um, he comes with a, the Cull Obsidian part. He's a big, tough guy who's uh, part of the Black Order. Comes with Stormbreaker. We'll talk about that later. And he comes with a, pretty, I would say it might be a brand new update to the old armor after he gets a hap, uh, Stormbreaker. But we'll talk about that soon enough. Anyways, let's take a tour on the box of one you're looking for. You can know what to find. So on the side you have nice uh, Chris Hemsworth with art. Uh, Chris Hemsworth, that's the name, artwork or picture or whatever. Photoshop anyways. On the back you have a nice picture of Thor with a, with a Stormbreaker. Let's see what the text has to say about when the state of the universe is thrown into chaos, Thor sets to both protect Earth and, and beyond. Pretty cool, right? So you have the other figures on the Obsidian, uh, call Obsidian Waves to build the figure. We'll get to the, each one, every one of these eventually this week, so I'm really jazzed about that. So, anyways, that side you have another picture of Chris Hemsworth, really looking real intense and fire in his eyes. Back to the front, you can tell which wave with call Obsidian on the top. Avengers logo on the top of there, another Legends on the top, Avengers Infinity War, and Thor on the bottom. So, it's time to shut up and start ripping the sucker open and uh, put him through the paces. Okay, so here he is. He's Thor from Infinity War. Looking very cool, I, might, I must say. I like how, you know, obviously it's taken from the movie, so naturally, you know, when he, uh, when he and, uh, Groot and Rocket help rebuild uh, what they call the God Killer weapon, the Stormbreaker, which obviously I'm holding with the uh, lightning effects and the Groot handle. Then, you know, obviously it's the old armor back up, which is pretty cool. And he uh, comes with the uh, Call Obsidian left arm. Well, we'll get to him later on. Anyways, take a look at the details. Just uh, pretty cool, right? And especially the eye. Which, you know, obviously you've seen the movie, so you know he gets a, a replacement from his blind eye. And, uh, yeah. Pretty cool. I love the detail on it. Check out the uh, cape. Anyways, now, uh, and the uh, markings and the details and the, the course of his power, I guess. So, anyways, let's uh, check its articulation, shall we? So... Thor's head goes back that far, goes forward that far, goes all the way around, and uh, can you turn side to side? Yep, a little bit. His arm goes up. Not so far, but that's okay, I guess. Uh, but he can turn all the way around, and he has bicep rotation. He has a, the double joint on the elbow. No calf rotation. I mean, uh, forearm rotation, but he has a back and forth and swivel on the wrist. He can go, his rope diaphragm goes back that far, goes forward that far, 
and rotation at the diaphragm, not the waist. That's interesting. Uh, legs go apart that far. Legs go forward and back that far. Rotation of the thigh. Double joint on the knee. No rotation of the calf, but he is back and forth on the ankle as you end a pivot. So, what do you say we uh, put him through some poses and uh, see how cool he looks? Okay, guys, so here I uh, obviously put him in a pose where he's holding uh, the Stormbreaker above his head with lightning going off. I added some of the uh, lightning effects from the uh, Thor Ragnarok 2 pack Thor. So, you know, I think it looks pretty cool. Looks outstanding to me. What do you guys think? You like it? You guys like it? Okay, so with the other two four Thor figures I've gotten, obviously I haven't put them in any flying poses. I've put them in a falling pose, but not one where he's, you know, in a flying pose with, like, the hammer laying away. So, you know, I think it looks pretty cool, right? Looks spectacular, I would say. What do you guys think? And here I have him in a quote-unquote putting the hammer down pose. You want me to put the hammer down? I think this looks pretty spectacular. What do you guys think? And here I try to replicate uh, Thor's uh, epic arrival back on Earth after getting Stormbreaker with uh, Rocket and Groot. And here I have him next to uh, the Ragnarok Thor, the uh, Gladiator Thor, and uh, the Ragnarok 2-pack Thor. Looking pretty cool, right? Okay, guys, so there you have it. So far, one of my more favorite figures from this past year. I really dig this figure a lot. It's the Infinity War Thor. I, with the exception, you know, one of a tight uh, joint on the shoulder, I really dig this figure. I really like it a lot. If you guys can find it, you know, you know, please do. Uh, should be around everywhere. If I can find it in New Hampshire, you guys should be able to find it everywhere. So, um, yeah, really awesome figure. I'm so happy I have it. So thank you guys for watching. I always appreciate the support. I appreciate all your comments. Wanted to thank Sam for uh, Sam Liu for uh, joining the subscriber squad. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. We're growing slowly, but you know, growing nonetheless. Uh, got over a hundred. I swear we will be doing that get Thor giveaway. I just had to find a little time and figure out the logistics about how to do it, but we will get to it. I swear. Um, next up in the Thor and the uh, Infinity War wave, I should say, the Black Widow from uh, Infinity War. So it should be pretty cool. I'm looking forward to it. So uh, thank you guys for watching so much. Uh, so I'll tell you, what figure are you looking forward to of this wave or in the near future that's coming out that you know of? So let me know in the comments below. I'm pretty good at answering a lot of them. So uh, thanks a lot, and uh, we'll see you next time.